Hey guys, stick around to the very end of this video for bonus footage. We had a close encounter in the dark with a train running backwards with no lights on this track. Check it out. Hey folks, we're in Harlan County in the community of Chevrolet. Yes, just like the car, Chevrolet. Chevrolet is a former mining camp. There used to be a mines up in there somewhere. The mines opened in the early 1900s, I think around 1918 or something. Now, now it is long closed and these few houses remain. I'm told that at one point in time in its heyday it had 50 homes or more for the miners. On this side and the other side yeah. of the road. This few, these few houses here and the ones across the road and there's some old chimneys across the road. We'll go look at those. Is the last remains of the, of the mining camp. But the reason we're here, once a year, these former camp houses in the former mining camp of Chevrolet, Kentucky, turns into Christmas Town. Folks, in the daylight, it does not do justice to what it looks like here. These people, at their own expense and with their own labor, decorates for Christmas every year and they have since 1969 if you can see that Chevrolet Christmas lights established 1969 Merry Christmas God bless think about that all those years, these people, and now uh, they're joined by their neighbors across the road. They decorate also. But these houses right here are spectacular after dark. And yes, folks, we're not going to come up here and tease you and talk about it and then leave. We're going to show you what they look like tonight. Are we not, Mrs. Cody? Yes, we are. So we're not, so hold on. You'll see the lights here in just a few minutes. The Chevrolet lights, right? Yeah. I mean, it's beautiful in the daylight, isn't it? It sure is, and when everything gets lit up, it just comes to life. Now, they move coal out of these hills here, quite a bit of it. I'm told the way this community got its name is the road was so rough up into this holler here the first car that got here was a Chevrolet that could make it here on the rough road. So they named the community Chevrolet. That's what I heard. Yep. <laughs> Is that a railroad track That's up there? That's what I was fixing that. Uh, yeah. Is that a railroad or a road? We'll have to ask one of the folks when we talk to them here in a little bit. I believe that could possibly be the railroad track they uh, uh, brought the coal out on. Okay. You know, in the night time, it's hard to believe it's just the three little houses on this side left yes. of the coal camp. Yes, so uh, the night time, it looks like a dozen houses, don't it? They sure have the Christmas spirit. Yeah, they, they sure, sure do. The and they share it with it. That, what yeah. they do here does so much to, to bring Christmas spirit to these beautiful hills of eastern Kentucky. I can't think of anywhere else a community this small does this much. Never have so few done so much for so many. <laughs> Excuse me, Mr. Churchill. But <laughs> <laughs> Anyway, and uh, like I said, the neighbors across the road where they have those chimneys, uh, they've joined in, and they yes. do, but the, the, this, this is where it started. They, they don't accept donations. They don't get paid. They do all of the Christmas decoration. Decoration? <laughs> decoration. Of course, we're going to go across the road, too. It's getting, yeah, it's getting cold. I'm getting frostbite on my tongue. <laughs> yes, we will. But this, folks, is the remains of the coal camp, which turns into Christmas Town, USA, every year and has since 1969. What? Folks, my wife knows a little bit more about this community than I do. What was you going to talk about, dear? Well, right in here in this wide spot, there used to be a big, tall house, I think a two-story house. And before this road, there was a road with a hump, and I would tell Daddy to speed up a little bit. I always try to speed up just a little bit, because it just gives you the woo in your belly, you know, 
Just these little thrill just to go over that little hump that was right up there. And well, I bet the kids on the school bus love yeah, that. Yeah, and when the school bus, it was always fun. You would want to go in the back and get and go up that, that little hump at that around that time. Well, does anybody remember that? But they used to be houses yeah. over here quite more than this that I can even remember. Hey, you wanna go up there and get that Christmas tree? That Christmas tree. Yeah, we'll, we'll just go up there and get it for Yeah, we'll just run right up there. It's so pretty. And get that Christmas tree. <laughs> right up there. And get that Christmas tree. And folks, we're across the road now, across the tracks. And these are the chimneys, the last remains from the old coal camp that was over here. I'm counting eight chimneys yep, right yeah. now. Yeah, and this I'm is the Chevrolet community. The now, the house, the only house over here, that one there, which does all this decoration. And you can go all the way around yep. here. Yeah, you can circle them, and we'll do that for you and tonight. And it's certainly yep. grown. Yep. Anyway, here. this don't actually look like an old camp house. It may, uh, it looks like it's a new built house, but this is a site, as you can tell, of many old camp houses. Like I over said, here I've in the counted eight yep. or nine. In chimneys. the Chevrolet coal camp. Yes. And folks, if y'all can think of a coal camp named after a Dodge or a Ford, tell us about it and where it's at, and we'll go do that. <laughs> See, you circle right here. Yeah. They got a little circle goes it around. It's a life at night, and I've noticed yeah. it's grown a lot. They've gotten a lot yeah. more bigger. Yeah. With yeah. It's just incredible yeah. that some. And we will drive you around this circle tonight, folks. Just Have no fear. Wow, look at those chimneys. One, two, three, four, oh, just right there. there. Might be ten. Well, they're back there too. There's four. <laughs> and up here is a five, six, seven at least. And look at this one. Imagine someone went up there and went through all that trouble yeah. to put those crosses on top of that chimney just for us. That's amazing. Just for you guys and us to enjoy it yeah. and get a blessing from it. Yes, and those are chimneys out there in the brush. It looks like a house seat right yeah. here. Look yeah. That, that that gives you an idea of just how big this coal camp was when it was booming. Well, folks, without further ado, let us get into DeLorean <laughs> and race ahead till tonight and let you see how this coal camp, former coal camp, turns into Christmas Town, USA after the sun sets. So y'all in a minute, have you got the door in warmed up? And folks, we just got out of the DeLorean and we have traveled three hours into the future. And this is what the coal camp looks like now. This camp literally turns into Christmas Town. <laughs> Isn't this amazing? This is Christmas. Yes. It don't this, feel like Christmas until I come up here. All the ghost all of Christmases. Christmas would have to do is bring Scrooge up here and let him see this. Yes. And, and right there, he could, they could have saved all the other trips is brought him here to this yes. little to this little village. What was his heart? Got bigger? Yeah. No, you're thinking about the uh, Grinch. Yeah, I'm talking about Scrooge. Yeah, the Grinch right here. Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> That's Whoville. Yeah. Now this is amazing. These folks, uh, the lady told us they've See, been. Yeah, the lady told us they've been offered money, uh -huh. and wouldn't take it. Yes, they yeah. do this absolutely out of love for yes. Christmas and for kids. Look up there, he's got it up in the mountains. Mistletoe. Oh yeah, mistletoe in the tree though. Look at the mistletoe up there. I'm telling you, they got some great. They got it in the mountains. Stuff. Look at that. Now, folks, this is what I try to show with my videos is that Santa Claus is uh there is so much life in these mountain communities uh uh, Santa uh Claus. and it's Santa it's Santa Claus <laughs> Merry 
Merry Christmas! Merry Christmas! <laughs> He's such a jolly Santa. <laughs> well, Santa is jolly. <laughs> what I was saying before we ran into Santa Claus is that's what we try to show on this channel. This right here is what this channel is all about. Is the spirit, the life that is in these small towns. You know, somebody come down to do a video, a news station to do a story, and show a former coal camp like this and talk about how, how economically depressed it is and how things are. They won't come around Christmas and show the life and the joy these people has. And happiness. And yeah, love. yeah. Uh, folks, there is life in these mountains. There's happiness, there's joy in these mountains. They're like every other place. There's good and bad. Standing up there watching and right this now, good smile and yeah. get a candy cane and, and see all this and well, see Santa Claus. I don't know, just the lady up. said they did it they because it. of the kids. The joy and look up the there. kids get. Oh my goodness. Yeah. So and look up there in the woods. Up in the woods you've yes, got. Yeah. It's they've growing. got it all the way up in the woods. It's spanking. growing every year. And look at the traffic coming up here to yeah, see the, this. To see those kids faces light up to yeah. see Santa. And this is early. Reason. This is early. The vehicles are just starting to come in. Little Cindy Lou. I think this is one of your favorites, this Whoville. Little Cindy Lou. Isn't it? Is it? Little Cindy Lou, yes. That's your favorite Whoville? Yes. I like this. Uh... Santa Claus. Yeah, oh, I like this. Christmas trees. I like them all. They're beautiful. Yep, there's no favorite. They're all. Yeah. The gingerbread. Like the gingerbread. And once again, look at all the traffic. These folks, people stops and they come out to the car and they interact with the children. They love the kids. And it's cold out here yeah. tonight. But if you got kids in your car and you stop and they're dressed up, they'll come out and they'll talk to the kids and interact with them. Yes. And we got the Grinch and Santa Claus. But this is the reformed Grinch, right? This yeah. is the post, the post Whoville Grinch who is reformed now. <laughs> That's right. Ho, ho, ho. All right, Merry Christmas to you guys, and this is so great that you all do this. I, I, I just would like to expose this to as many people as I could out of the gym. I mean, it's just three little houses here. You drive by the nighttime, you think it's six or seven, you know. <laughs> really, uh, it, it, it's great. Thank you all so much for what you do. Uh, when do y'all start? Around Thanksgiving, I think. Somebody well, told me. First time of all, Thanksgiving. Yeah. And when do you start putting the lights up? October. Wow. October. Early October. Early October. <laughs> I guess you got to get the head start on that one. Right? Wow. And you've been doing it since 1969 when we was on the highway down wow. here. The houses got torn yeah. down for the highway. Oh, well, that's, 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 that's good info. And look at the traffic coming in now. Yeah. And this is just starting. This is just starting. And folks, the, 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 this is free. This is for the joy of this. I know in this day and age it's hard to, to figure out something, you know. Well, what's the angle of that? No the way. angle of this is they love to see people be happy. Yes. Especially kids. Uh, these, these are really great people. God bless them for so what they do. down to Chevrolet and get the yeah. Christmas Yeah, Chevrolet. Right? That's right. There's one more house in the lower bottom. Yeah. Uh, we're going to go do a, we, we're gonna do a drive. We visited that day when we drive around. Yeah, uh, those uh, those there. chimneys over there, that's from old coal camp houses, yeah. ain't yes, they? Okay. Right. I didn't want to misidentify them there. Thank you people so much and God bless you.
Merry Christmas, Merry Christmas from, from Chevrolet, Kentucky. Now folks, we're going to go across the road and across the tracks like we done today to the house. That's right, this is one house over here that does this. I love those flashing lights. Don't you? Yeah, and there's some over here on this side too, but yeah. it's hard to get both. <laughs> No, we can kind of get both. There's the house, the actual house itself. There. Show their decorations they've got on their house. And then we'll bring it back over here. If they got so much, it's hard to get it in one drive by. That's true. You actually have to go and circle it twice to yeah. get, get everything. Look at that beautiful uh, Ferris wheel. Ferris wheel, yeah. Beautiful. Way out there. And there's one of the old chimneys. I love these little trees with the twinkling, shimmering lights. Aren't they so pretty? Mm -hmm. And if you look in the distance, you can see the traffic still going around over across the road. This is just so beautiful. This community just lights up. There it is, got the Christmas yeah. spirit, I'm telling you. They just love Christmas. Look, Santa Claus like. You know, thank these people. Thank you all so much. For giving Each, us the joy to be able to enjoy this. Every family that does yes. this goes to, to the trouble of doing this every year. Thank you all so much for sharing your Christmas spirit with us. Most of all, thank you for not charging us. <laughs> <laughs> wow, look at those big yeah. lights there. Yeah, look at those big oh, lights. My I like those big Christmas lights, but that is big. <laughs> those are. That's. Y'all done amazing. That yeah. is beautiful. Y'all did good. The Chevrolet Missionary Baptist Church. And they have a live manger scene. They do. And this is a live nativity scene right here at the Chevrolet Baptist Church. Talk about all the Christmas spirit at Chevrolet. Hey, thank the great folks at the Chevrolet Missionary Baptist Church and their wonderful pastor, Eddie Huckleby, for sharing their nativity scene with us. And they've had a really good crowd for it tonight. And thank the folks here at Chevrolet for sharing their Christmas spirit with all of us. What do we all say? Merry, Merry Christmas! Christmas! Bye. Bye. Did we just miss a train? No, there's one coming. The crossing ain't working. Here. It's empty. Oh my God, it's coming, Dad. There's no lights on it.